When you load virtual instruments into Cubase and Noendo, there's a common way and there is a fast way. I'll show you the most common way. You can press this plus and choose instrument and now we can choose contact and the audio output. You can enter a name or we do a right click and then choose add instrument track. You can choose the contact and the audio output. Okay, let's add this one. And now we've got a new instance of contact. And here is the other way. Now let's add show height right zone. So not this one, but this one right here in the right. So you can see we've got the meter, control room, we've got media and the virtual instrument that are loaded. And now we go back to media and press with T instruments. And now you can see all the instruments. And now let's choose battery. Just go to here, drag and drop it. And here it's done. So let's choose uh, another one here. Let's choose contact. Now you can see contact. The next one or let's do the library hammers and here is the library hammers by spitfire audio so what you can't choose here is the uh, output and you can't type in a name so when you want to change the output i do it here let's say we've got a few groups and let's say we got three groups so this group is called bass and this drums and this strings i can go to hammers open the direct routing and then i can say i want to route it to the drums or i could go to the channel settings and do the routing here so this has been a short trick how to load an instruments very fast. When you like this short video, then please give me a thumb up. It would make me very happy and see you next time. Bye.